Members of HPA are here together to protest and demand that the Affordable Care Act be saved. The ACA has come a long way to get care for a lot of people that we take care of in the country, and it needs to be continued. With education, there's power, and we need to share our knowledge and speak up for those children who cannot speak for themselves. They need advocacy, and that's what we're here for today. We are here to save lives, to make sure we save people's health insurance. This is a fight for our lives, the lives of our friends and family members and neighbors, and it is a fight that we're going to work to make sure continues to be health care for 20 million Americans and protections for millions more. The HPA is on the front lines of this fight. They are dealing with people every single day uh, who are being affected by this. And we need everybody who believes like they do to stand up, to lobby, to call the Congress people, to insist and demand that we don't put the country in crisis. I had a massive heart attack. My stay for the 12 days that I was in a hospital was over a million dollars. If I lose my health care, I will die. Because of the ACA, I can stand here proudly. I can battle my invisible illnesses because President Obama and these federal representatives here with us today saw it fit that people like me deserve a minimum standard of living. We've taken everyone who other hospitals will not take in, and we have seen an improvement in the care of our patients. It's not just for the rich and famous. Everyone's entitled to live and have good health. We want to save everyone. The people who oppose the Affordable Care Act don't realize that for millions of Americans, before it, we were one medical emergency away from financial ruin. Taking health care away from people who need it and creating situations that could result in their untimely death, damn it, is un-American. We're going to be resisting the dismantling of democracy and all the other un-American things that are being proposed that are not good for the people who are the citizens of this great country. We are a nation founded on the ideal of life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Healthcare is a right enshrined in our constitutional value. We are a nation where we pledge to liberty and justice for all. There is no justice with no health care. Will we let the Republicans led by Donald Trump come and assault our values and our ideals and the bottle of them? Or will we stand up and fight? The future of the country is here because the power of the people is greater than the people in power.